everyone i welcome you once again to this tutorial this is where we have stopped so let's launch our database file so we have created i've told uh, i've told you to create the all the subjects a query so as you can see i've created for career technology computing creative art english french Ghana language mass i even create query for query this one is already created rme science and social i have created it for all of the subject and i urge you to also do the same thing very very important now after you have created the query for each of the subject ensure that the sort the sort is at ascending order you sort ascending order okay we did for all the subjects okay we put it on ascending order rme you change the view and you put it at what ascending order we do for the registry also you change the view it's already done do for mass change the view and do it Do for Ghana language, change the view and put it at ascending order. So, do it for all the subjects. I'll close and say yes. Uh, I'll close them. I'll say yes. Close. Close. And I'll say yes. I'll close them all and say yes i'll say yes so control s to save everything so do it for ghana language which i believe i have done i've done for ghana language do for french change the view and do it for french also control x to save that when you are closing it, it will not give you that prompt. Do for English, change the view. It's done, so close it. For career, creative art, change the view and ensure that it is done. Control S to save your work and then close it. Do for computing, change the view. And ensure that the sort is at ascending order. Make sure you save your work. Do for career technology. Change the view. Ensure that the sort is at what? Ascending order. That's good. That's good. That's good. That's good. Now let's continue. We want to create a new query mm. and we want to call this query uh, it's a query for the brush sheets okay we want to create a new query so go to create so you can be at uh, let's take it let's start for with English so be here and go to create and go to query design now go to query you are not going to use table you're going to use query because we want to create formula for remark position etc 
formula for remark position, class teachers comment, head teachers comment, and then a promotion status, either it is promoted or repeated. We will not need the table. We use the, we want to build or create another query from an existing query. So we are working with English. So bring the English query. Okay. Bring the English query. And then click on the, after that, just close. Click on the asterisk over here. And this asterisk will bring everything in this query. Okay. So click here and run. If you run, it will bring everything. You see, it has bring everything for you. It has bring everything. So click here to change the view. Now, we will, we will add column to this grid. We'll add column. We'll add column. So I will send you the file, this file. I'll send it to you. So just copy the whole of this. Control C to copy. And come here. Come to the first column. And click on the builder. And paste it there. Okay. Okay. Now this is explaining the this is the grid letter. If the student score greater than 80, uh, it should bring uh, HP that is a uh, highly proficient. What we have done in Excel, that is the same thing we are doing in what in access. Okay. So that's the meaning of what you are done. It should be greater than uh, the if the English total if the English hundred score is greater than seventy nine, bring hot HP. If the English hundred percent score is greater than sixty seven, bring P, which is what proficient in that order. So click on OK. Okay, let's check some to go to builder. So let's check. So this is supposed to have one. So one, two, three, four. Okay. Okay, so before that, let's save our query. So control X to save your query. Okay. If you, so let's click on, okay. Control X. Let's save our query. We'll call it, uh, uh, now we'll call it English. English broadsheet. So we are going to call it all English broadsheet. So English broadsheet. Click on OK and this form. It will run for us. It will run for us. It will run as you can see that the English grid is working. It is working. That's perfect. So we now know the English grade of the student. Now we want to look at the position in class. The position in class. So change the view and then come here and then I will give you this uh, formula. You just copy this. Uh, copy this over here. But before that I want to do some correction. We are working with English, so we expect an English uh, symbols. So here should be English, not signs. Okay. So I'll delete it so that when I send the formula to you, you will not be doing those corrections inside. 
Okay, so that's perfect. So I'll clean, I'll copy the whole of this and then I'll go and paste it at the next column. So I'll click on Builder and then I'll paste it over there. Now this formula is saying that uh, this formula is an SQL statement. It's an SQL statement. Uh, it's saying that uh, uh, compare the query English twice. Compare the uh, the English query twice. And the uh, asterisk here means uh, count every thing in the in the in what in the query. Count everything in the query. So we are comparing the two queries or the two queries uh, twice. Okay, you are comparing to one twice. Okay, this will give us the position. When you compare it twice, it will give us the position. So click on OK and then run. And I believe it has to work. So if you look at the score of this guy, uh, this guy has 80, this one has 0. So this guy is first and this guy is second. Let's proceed. Let's go to our, our formula sheet and then let's look at the position. The position. In asset, this is how we use to find position. It's a little different in that of uh, Excel. Okay, so let's copy the term. Let's copy. Let's change the view. And let's paste it here. Control. Let's go to the builder and then you paste it here. So let me explain uh, what is here. Let me explain what is there. And then that space. Let me leave that space. Okay, so uh, if the position is subject, if the position subject is one twenty, if it's one, if it's one, I have to add eleven here. So it's be eleven have to be here. So eleven. So eleven. So if the position, the person had one, eleven, twenty-one, thirty-one in that order. Uh, what you do is that. What you do is to add first. Okay. The eleventh, we don't have. Uh, okay, so let's clean it. There will be no eleventh. Okay, you should add what uh, st to that. So if the person had one, it should be first. If the person have twenty one, it should be twenty first, thirty first, forty first in that order. But if the student had two, twenty two, uh, thirty two. It should be what? You add what? ND, second, 22nd, in that order. So if the person had 3, 23, in that order, the person should, you add what? RD, RD, and then if it's the order we run, add what? NT, so that's the meaning, so click on OK. Let's run this formula to see if it will work. So scroll down. Uh, reduce this side so that sc scroll, scroll down. So you see, it's giving us first, second in that order. That's perfect. Let's continue. We need the remarks. So just copy the remark. Copy the remark. Control C to copy. And then change the view and come here. Go to builder and paste it over here. So leave, don't leave a space over here. So this is talking about the remarks. If you compare the English 100% score 
and is greater than 79 bring code highly proficient in that order that's what you have done in the first one so we just click on ok and let's run so I I run it I will not get into this error you can see that I haven't got into this error so that is perfect so we have done for English brush sheet so you have to do it for all the subjects so control X to save your work okay so I'll change this one to yeah then I'll go to uh, let me do for I have done for English so let me do for career technology let me do for career technology I'll do for all the subjects so come here and go to create and go to create design and bring career technology not table career technology but rather query so go to so career and click on add and then close click on the asterisk to bring everything now uh, this is what to do go to first of all save your work control s name it uh, uh, this is what career technology brush it so career underscore technology broad sheet okay click on ok now go to the English brush sheet then come to the gray letter click on the builder we are just going to copy so control select all control C to copy control C to copy now uh, now you can close this one you can close it say yes so now this is what I'll do okay so I, I will reopen this one I'll reopen this one and this is the trick that I will use to do so I will open this one control V to paste then I'll go to replace and then I'll write English that is ENG and I'm replacing your career technology what I'll use uh, C A R then click on replace all say ok replace all say ok then now just select the whole of this and control X to cut now minimize this and then go to the career technology brush sheet and then paste it here go to the builder and then paste it here just click on ok run the query you can see that it has come so go to the english brush sheet and copy the position so go to builder and copy this position Control C to copy, close the table, go to Microsoft Word, paste it here, go to replace, and then click on replace all. So after you place all, just Control A to select everything, Control X to cut, then to come to the career, te career technology brush sheet, change the view. And come here, go to Builder, and then paste it there. Click on OK, run. Okay, let me see. The Aster Database Engine cannot find the input table, so there's a, a mistake somewhere. So I will go and correct that. So that's the mistake. Go to the Builder. And here should be rather career. That's what you have written. I believe you have written career technology. Okay, so it should be. Okay, that's it. So click on it to select. It should be. Here should be rather what? Career technology. That's perfect. Okay, that's select this. That's good. So click on OK. Then run the. Now it has picked. It has picked. It has picked. It has picked. Okay. So change the view. 
now go to english broadsheet now we have done with this and this let's come here go to the builder and copy everything here copy okay yeah you come to the uh, correct technology broadsheet you just paste there's nothing you need to do just paste it here click on ok run the query the reason why I run the query is to see if it is working or not see it is working so change the view go to English and then you have done one two three this level the remark the remark okay the remark so go to builder and then copy the whole of this and then click on ok and now you can close you can close the english brush sheet if you like close it so save your work now go to the word and paste it now go to replace and select replace all click on ok and then select Control A to select or Control X to cut. Then come and paste it here. Yeah. Click on the builder. And then click on paste. You, I say click. You <laughs> use the keyboard shortcut Control uh, Control plus what? As v to paste. Click on OK. Run the query see if it's working it is working perfectly i'll do another one for you and you will do the rest okay so i have done for correct technology broadsheet so let me do for computing so i'll click on computing i'll go to create i'll go to query design now because you are working with query so you select query query then go to a computing computing Computer close it select the asterisk to add everything Control X to save your work. Here we we'll call it what? Computing Computing what? Broadsheet Okay, so you call it bro computing broadsheet. That's correct. Now come to the correct technology Change the view. Come to the the this thing, the grid later. Click over here. Go to builder, and then copy the whole of that. Control C to copy. Select it first, and go to Word. Word is there to help us. Control V to paste. Then go to replace. Now here we write C A R, and here is computing. So compute your C O M P. Click on replace all and click on OK. Now control A to select all, control X to cut, minimize this and come to the computing broadsheet. Come here, go to builder and paste it over here. Click on OK. Now around the, the query, you can see that it has come. Yeah, I didn't add any student mark so you see that it's it's giving you this okay so change the view now come to career technology come to the position the position is the same so you can use your already okay i'll go for my already uh, my already okay i'll just copy this okay come here go to builder just copy control a to select all control c to copy then click on okay then uh, now this one will not use them uh, the distance the microsoft will just go to the the tip the query that you're working on come here and go to builder and paste it inside now let's do the correction. Here will not be career technology, but here will rather be uh, computing. So select computing. Here will be what? 
so just delete here so select computing now change C A to C O M P as you are working on computing so just click on yes you also change to computing please do as I do very important okay we are working on computing so everything must be in computing so click on ok run let me check and see that it's working yes do have the same position because it has the result that's so click on the view now go to career technology we are working on this one so click here go to builder and then copy the whole of select all to copy select all and then copy Control c to copy and click on ok then come to the computing brush sheet and then come here go to builder paste it the control v to paste click on ok i'll not run it come here go to we are done this already let's go to the remark click on builder copy the whole of this and then go to word control v to paste now we will do the replace so I'm replacing it with computing replace all click on ok just click on closed control a to select or control x to cut now you can close it you can remove it like that so you are going to do for all the subjects so i will do for three subjects and you will do for the rest so come here and go to builder and paste it there click on ok now let's run it and see how they are looking like so you see that all of them are looking perfectly so control x to save your work and you uh, do for all the subjects so do for all the subjects please after you do for all the subjects now yours is to take a screenshot if you're able to do for this take a screenshot of this uh, you see that i've done for career technology brush it computer brush it english brush it okay take the screenshot and send it to me okay very important thank you very much for unveil yourself for this class see you in the next section in our next section uh, we will be looking at a lot of things we'll create a query for school details then We'll do a whole lot of things so don't worry see you very soon bye please subscribe to this channel like comment you can even share so that others can also benefit from this course